All right, sup, sup, everyone. Welcome to episode one of uh, Genshin Memory, where, where the only the dankest of memes will survive this. I, I'll be honest with you guys. So if you guys want to submit your own memes, you can join my Discord server, which is going to be in the link down in the description. And there is going to be a channel called Genshin Memory, where every week we're going to wipe it and then start anew. So if you like some of these memes, you want to save them, uh, you got to be updating yourselves weekly, going, sifting through them, having the ones you like, saving them. Them, all right because i have to clean this out weekly so that next week i'll be able to do another meme review let's see how long we can go for meme reviews i'm excited i hope the community is excited i don't see many people really digging deep into the meme culture of genshin not that i'm uh well versed in it or anything but i just enjoy memes i think they, they're, they're a ton of fun all right so without further ado maybe we need an intro for this i don't know we'll see if there's an intro or not all right let's go meme number one let's see let's see what's going on here hey stop <laughs> oh you see the <laughs> okay this meme this meme is is interesting because it's just a, it's a waifu battle this is listen all right there's a couple categories of memes in genshin and this is like your typical waifu battle meme it really doesn't matter it really doesn't matter it would have it would have made sense if you put right in here it would actually it would have made more sense if you put right in here right the glory of you know electro is forever for example but it's funny because these these two elements they go together with each other without hydro you cannot have freeze i don't know I don't know. I am Team Ayaka, though. I am Team Ayaka. I think the bangs are the one that what does it for me. I think uh, Yellen, while she is enticing, I don't enjoy getting whipped. What did he say? Oh. Or I don't enjoy getting hurt. So that's gonna be that. Leave it at there. Any further, we're gonna we're gonna stir up trouble. Now, what is this? Oh yeah, I, I saw this one. Theory crafted roasting erotic walrus. Okay, <laughs> I'm reading these about EGC theories. If you listen, you have to be a tier nine memer to even understand what the hell this is referring to if you guys aren't like really dabbling in multiple communities going through different memes tuning into live streams right you guys will have no idea what this meme is about <laughs> egc theory i like it though i i like it Listen, listen, Raiden, all right? I don't want to brag or anything, but you know that it turns. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. We are, we're delving into another hard category called the cursed category. When, when the meme hits you so damn hard, it's so, it's hitting so hard that you feel like it's straight out of somebody's diabolical nightmare. Like somebody literally had a nightmare that's related to Genshin. They woke up and they just turn it into a meme. It's, yeah, this is some cursed stuff, people. This is some cursed stuff. The cursed memes, gotta love them as well. They don't always hit, but when they do, they stick. Every masterpiece has its cheap copy i feel like this could be a, a format couldn't it this literally can be a format you can put coke you can put coco me here and put barbara here oh it is a format raiden shogun here electro mc this is this is good i, I look forward to seeing more of this stuff like you know it's something that the audience may a, a recurring meme this is listen this is episode one this is gen one memes we'll, we'll see how this goes we'll see how this goes me getting into genshin is this meme still alive? Is this meme format? <laughs> Should have added like a AR AR like ten or fifteen or something. Because I think that's when that's when you really fell into the the Genshin rabbit hole when you were like early. Because a lot of people ended up quitting before they even reached AR twenty. It's like oh no, no this is not for me. But once you get past AR twenty twenty five, you really get sucked into it, right? You're, you're every day you're just like I need more, I need more, I want more. And when you're past AR-55, maybe AR-57, 58, you start being like, okay, I, I want to get out, but I can't. Now you really be like, how can I get out of this? I feel this. All right, I feel this. I feel this to my core. <laughs> I like this. Because, you know, okay, what's, oh, should I say it? Should I not say it? 
Ah, fuck it, I'm gonna say it. You know, it's... It's funny, because if you look at this, and contextually, it's funny, right? Because, you, uh, you know, she's a fish. Ah, uh, funny. But, I want you all to take your hands and cover up the look. And it literally, right now, looks like a rule. This happens way more than you guys would believe. And people sometimes don't understand. Let's say you're at 30 pity. 30 pity, eh, it's about like, what? 4,800 gems, right? 30 pity. You spend 4,800 gems. You know like how much, how many gems 4,800 gems is to a free-to-play player? Why risk it? Right? Why, why risk it? Kuki Shinobu is going to become a character on the standard banner eventually. Why risk it? And you know what's the worst part? A lot of these people just want Kuki Shinobu just so they could have her and not even build her. So they're literally getting this character just so they could sit in their inventory. It is tragic. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. <laughs> I knew it was coming. <laughs> Wait, but they don't even have the same last name. This person's last name is Edith. This person's last name is Musk. Are they like half related oh edith is so her name is edith musk one got married so the little sister got married but wait this actually doesn't make any sense yeah but people don't usually use doctor with the first name they usually use doctor with the last name no this is a rabbit hole we can't get stuck here <laughs> what <laughs> Isn't she blind? Evil cock! <laughs> I think as we go into newer regions, shouldn't they just like design some new NPCs? I swear, like Inazuma, um, Liyue and Mondstadt have very similar people every now and then. Like, you just feel like, uh, that person seems familiar. What's with the community and this cross-dressing fetish? I swear. You can't... You can't get away from it. Why? Why? I mean, hey, listen. It's all cool if people are into this stuff. But the obsession, man, this is an obsession. And I don't think it's like, it are, it's just like, are girls more into this? This is like, uh, there's a portion of the female fandom who's like, oh, they would look cute if they wore X, Y, and Z. I think the girls are really into this. Like, oh, that's cute. Look how cute they are. Damn, this is, this is a dangerous, this is a dangerous trap to fall into, people. This is a dangerous trap. Mmm. It's an acquired taste. I do think, but it's weird, right? Because I do think, wow, Albedo looks really cute there. But then I'm just like, you know what I mean? Because I know Albedo's, well, he has an anatomy of a dude. Who knows? Venti, of course, Venti doesn't care because Venti is an Archon. Archons are like, in a way, genderless, right? Like, gender is, a, is like, a, like a human construct thing. So, of course, the Archon doesn't care. Same with like, A, same with Zhongli. They wouldn't really care. Venti could have chose to, to come into this world in a different body but i think maybe the friend was a female i don't know i don't know this is such a big part of the fandom and i'm really scared every time i get in because it, it makes me think like damn xiao looks pretty cute you know kazuha blushing damn that's kind of that's kind of cute and albedo kind of cute i'm just like wait hold up a minute why am i like and my eyes don't even glance towards the girls in the bottom half i'm just looking at all the dudes i'm thinking they're all cute this is this is scary stuff man this is scary stuff i knew i knew there was gonna be memes about food the, the whole food system in genshin i don't eat food that much in genshin i don't really rely on food i've never had the need for food and i've never needed to take like crit rate crit damage food to deal more damage so i don't really get into food food yeah to revive i make i have a lot of the like that's it like revive yeah, I guess, I guess that's the only one. And it's very rare that I die to begin with. Only when I'm playing new characters, like level 40 character, fighting level 90 boss, I'm like, oh, I'm dead. But then again, I just teleport to an Archon statue and I come back. So I guess if I use the revive food, 
and then I die again in the same fight, then yeah, then I have to go to the Archon Statue. <laughs> okay, I'll be honest. Like, I find Dane's Leaf as a character to be too heavily leaned upon by Hoyoverse to be like a, a tool for story progression. Yes, they try to make it seem like, oh, he comes and goes for reasons, but it feels too forced for the most part, to my liking. Right, it just feels like when it's convenient for Hoyoverse, they slap him in. When it's inconvenient for them, be like, oh, well, now he has to go now to do go do something. It just feels unnatural. And it always makes me feel like, you know, they're just um, purposely drawing out the story. It's like a start and stop quest as opposed to like a flowing storyline. It's a shame because they, they, they have to draw it out. They can't just like release everything, right? So they have to put reasons for, for Dane's leave to, to disappear, to go do other things. Maybe in the future, they will show us what he was doing behind the scenes and it'll all make sense that could be a great payoff but i doubt that they're gonna be so intricate to the point where they're gonna justify his time away uh as contributions to the story it's really just to stop the story chop it up a new <laughs> Dude, this is so I sus. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> okay, now. Come on. <laughs> A little content. <laughs> hey, come on. Okay, some of these are are quite forced, but some of them are really good. This. Hear me coming. Ben, it always comes. Okay, some of these are forced, but some of these are really good. Okay. Okay. We're done with the memes this week. Oh, made it to the end. All right. If you guys made it to the end, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how you managed to do it. We made it to the end for the most part. They're pretty dank. All right, there was a couple ones that were really, really, really good. But we need to see more dankness. We need to see more degeneracy in these memes, people. Thank you guys so much for submitting all these memes. Um, we'll also be trying to do a meme review. Maybe we need to squeeze it down a little bit. Maybe we're not able to do like the full two hour stream. But this was fun. Nonetheless, I had a good laugh. Hope you guys had a good laugh. And I hope to see you guys on the next one. All right. Until then, urge you all to stay safe. Peace, peace. Bye.